Astronomy GCSE Topic 15, The Milky Way. What does the Milky Way look like with the naked eye? Well, if you go out in the countryside, away from all light pollution, on a nice dark night, uh, clear skies, you will see this cloud stretching across the sky. It's very, very easy to mistake it for a cloud, but it's not a cloud, it's the Milky Way. Uh, a wide band in the sky that resembles a cloud. If you look at it with a, a telescope, you will see that it's actually made up of lots and lots and lots of stars, as Galileo was the first person to do. Okay, but it resembles a wide band in the sky that resembles a cloud. We can't see all of the stars in the Milky Way because there's a lot of dust, a lot of rubbish in between us and the center of the Milky Way. Some facts about the Milky Way. This obviously isn't a photo of the Milky Way, but it's a galaxy very similar to it. Uh, the Milky Way, it's an SBB galaxy. It's a spiral with a bar-shaped core, four clearly defined spiral arms. Its diameter is about 100,000 light years. The disk is about 1,000 light years thick, about 200 billion stars. It rotates once every 230 million years uh, and a lot of its mass is something called dark matter. In topic 16 we'll talk about that. Looking sideways uh, at the disk there is well it's all within a big cloud uh, a sphere of gas and dust called the halo. Within the halo there are old stars and there are things called globular clusters okay uh, we have the disk inside the disk there are open clusters uh, there is a bulge of stars around the middle and at the very center there is a supermassive black hole on this diagram that black circle on the left that's kind of whereabouts our sun is in the milky way we're about two-thirds out from the center Two types of clusters, globular clusters and open clusters. Learn some facts about them. Globular clusters, it's a spherical collection of stars, uh, tightly bound by gravity. You find them in the halo and they are old. They are old stars, so a sphere of old stars close together in the halo, a globular cluster. Open clusters, they are loosely bound, a loosely bound collection of stars. They are younger stars, and these are found in the disk. Uh, maybe you recognize this open cluster. It is the Pleiades. How do we know about the structure of the Milky Way? Uh, we got a lot of information from 21 centimeter radio waves. Why? Because they are emitted by hydrogen and there's an awful lot of hydrogen out there. So by detecting these 21 centimeter radio waves, by detecting their intensity, uh, where they're coming from, we can work out how much of it there is, how far away they are, uh, and from their Doppler shift, from red or blue shift, we know if they're moving towards us or away from us, and we've figured out the structure of the Milky Way uh, by using these 21 centimeter radio waves emitted by hydrogen.